Hi everyone, here we are live this morning, um, ready to do our Tabata workout and I posted a photo of it in the group. So um, if you are joining, make sure you give me a thumbs up that you can hear and everything is good. Um, and hopefully you all are gonna be taking part so I'm not doing this by myself because this is super weird right now and very depressing. I'm also, um, oh, hi guys, hi Kyle, hi Steph, hi Linda. Sarah is with me though, so I have one person. However, I will not be playing music today um, because Facebook doesn't allow me to play other music. So we're just gonna have the clock going and we're gonna do it without any music. And if you guys wanna play your own music, I would get that set up right now so you can actually choose your own playlist, which is great. Um, so we're going to all start. I know some of you are joining, which is awesome. We're going to start with a warm up. Okay. So we're just going to start with our shoulders forward. It's cold in here at the gym right now. Um, but you guys all remember that. And we're going to go backwards. If you have any questions, you know, you can post it and I can see comments, although it's weird because I do have to. Okay, good. <laughs> awesome, Linda and Bonita Springs. Um, um, just post a question and I have to get close to my phone to see it because I'm blind as a bat. Arm forward. <laughs> and reverse. All I can hear now is the creaking of my body. Swing both arms. And crisscross in front. So all you guys need today is, you don't even need any weights or anything, just find a small place in your living room and you guys can do this. You should do this, you should take part in this because this is what's gonna keep us sane, honestly. Wrist circles during this time, it's just, it's really hard to be kind of isolated, especially if you're used to seeing a lot of people during the day, like I am, so I'm ready to like, Go insane, but twists. I'm trying to make the best of it, I guess. Good. And we're gonna do some hip circles. I talked to Gretchen this morning and I'm like, thanks for giving me this workout. So every, I can hear my own breathing the whole time. Reverse. It should be a good one. And I'm going to go over it in a few minutes after we do a little bit of a warm up. Arms straight out, legs are wide, toe touch. Down and all the way up, warming up our hamstrings. And reach to the side, stretching out the side of your body. And standing on our left foot, let's do a right leg swing. Hopefully you guys can hear me okay. Give me a thumbs up if you can hear me fine. I understand the video yesterday was muted, so I'm hoping today it's not. Can you guys hear me? Okay, good, thank you, awesome. And ankles now, turning your ankles, rotating them, warming them up, getting all the joints moving in our body here. Other side. And let's do some squats, sitting way back, working our glutes, sitting back, chest is up. Good, now we are going to step back with our right leg into a lunge and kick it forward. Again, more warm ups on for our hamstrings, the backs of our legs and our hip flexors. There we go. One more. 
All right, now we're gonna just jog in place a little bit, nice and easy. <laughs> just warm up, nothing crazy. And back and forth, like you're doing cross country skiing. And let's do a few skiers here. Good, and jog. Let's do some butt kicks. Good, and let's take our right leg back and circle it. Circle it out. Warming up our hips. And reverse. I'm going to switch sides. I have some KT tape on my hip. I have a little bit of a nagging weird injury. So if you see any lumps in my yoga pants, that's why it's all starting to curl up. Reverse. All right. Inhale up. Grab your left wrist, lean to the side, back to center, switch sides, up and down, and sway from left to right as you're down. There we go. Plant those hands, step it back into a down dog and pedal your feet. And hopefully if you're watching at home, you're not skipping this part of the workout because if you do, you put yourself at a risk to get injured and, as we all know, bring it to an up dog. That stinks being injured because it puts us out for a while. And back to down dog. One more time, up dog, stretching on our backs and our hips. And down dog. And walking those feet in. Slowly rolling up. And let's take a look at our workout. All right, we're gonna walk over to the board here. Hi, Sarah, okay. All right, so this is what we're gonna do, guys, today. We're doing Tabata 2010 for six times. What does that mean? You guys all know that are watching 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We're doing each exercise six times in a row. However, the difference is during our rest time, which is that 10 seconds, we're actually not resting. We're gonna be jogging in place. Yay, okay. So our first, um, can you hold this, Sarah? So our first exercise, butt kickers, we're just gonna be going like this, kicking our butt. Then for 20 seconds, then during the rest, nice easy jog, okay? Then again for 20 seconds, butt kickers, okay? That's the first one. Cross jacks. We'll be jumping jacks, but we're crossing our legs, which is good because sometimes I feel like I have to pee my pants when I do these. So that's good. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not actually kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's cross jack. Plank hand to shoulder. You're going to be in a plank. All right? Big, full plank, hand to shoulder. And then during those 10 seconds, you're going to jump up and jog. So that one's kind of hard because you're going to be going up, down, up, down. Power knees. First, we're going to do our right knee, powering it up. All right? And then our left knee, powering it up. All right? So we'll be doing three each side. And again, in between, jogging. Our fifth exercise will be a squat with a front kick. Squat, alternating leg. Okay, squat, sitting back, keep those chests up when you do this. Then we're gonna be doing a jump up. So, oh my God, all right, pretty scary. All right, so we're gonna jump and just reach up. Reach up, four more, you can just jump up. Okay, modification, reach, bend down, reach, okay? Using those arms, that's what arms above your head help to get your heart rate up, and that's what you want. You want to be breathing heavy, like I am right now, but 
That's what makes your heart get stronger as you increase that, okay? And then the final one will be upside down toe touches. We're reaching for your toes. This one, I'm not going to make you jump up and jog. We're going to just do a hold, a bridge hold here, okay? During that 10 seconds. So as you're doing this, you're engaged, legs, glutes, hold it. I know we did this yesterday in class, but that's fine. You probably shouldn't be sore from this. All right, so you're gonna do that. And that's what it is. So we're gonna get started. And I have the clock set over here. Where do you wanna do it, Mom? Um, I guess right where I was, we'll do it. Okay. Or do you think they wanna see the clock? Let us know, do you guys wanna see the clock? Can you put a thumbs up or no thumbs up if you care about seeing the clock? Because we can, I can work out in front of the clock if you want to see it. I think you probably do want to see it. That's my guess. Yeah. I, no, it? I don't see anything, but okay. Kyle said her ceiling fan is in the way. Her ceiling fan? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do it. I Hi, Stephanie. So you guys can see the clock. We'll try to set this up. Over here, Sarah, hold on to me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Uh, all right. Don't care about the clock. Okay, thanks, Steph. All okay, right. Get back in your thing. I'll set it up. You're in the way. Yeah. <laughs> all right. This is good. All right. Here we go, guys. We're going to start with butt kickers, okay? So. It's back. The clock is backwards anyway, so it doesn't oh, matter. Oh, yeah. The clock is backwards, so it doesn't matter. But ready? Let's begin. Up kickers. Trying to lift those heels towards your butt. Twenty seconds seems long when there's no noise. <laughs> and now bring it to an easy jog during those ten seconds. Don't forget this part. This is what's going to make this workout a little tougher. And back to butt kicks. Anyone saying anything I need to answer? No. Okay. We will be posting this video to this group so anyone during the day, bring it to a jog, can watch it and do it any time of the day that they want. So that will be the benefit. Back to buckets. We will have a minute break in between each exercise for you guys to grab a drink. All right, but a minute goes by fast, so don't go do a load of laundry in between because you missed stuff. <laughs> Good job. We are halfway through the butt kick. Hopefully you guys have music so you're not listening to me breathe because it's super annoying. <laughs> no, that's okay. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. See you guys. Okay, I'm back. Sarah's giving me an iPod so I can actually listen to something. Yeah, yeah. Although I don't know if I even want to listen to her music. <laughs> Just kidding. Bring it to a jog. And my kicks. It's our last one, guys. Can they see the clock at all? No, and it's backwards, so that's your right, right in front of it. Okay, I'm not gonna, not gonna freak them. Someone just said something. All right, take a break. It's a minute. Let's see. <laughs> You're welcome, Amanda. I'm glad you guys are 
happy we're doing this. I wish, I'm just like, I wish this wasn't happening, but we're gonna try to make the best of it. So you guys have about 40 seconds left of a break. Grab a drink of water now. We're going into cross jacks next. left. Our next exercise will be cross jacks. 10 seconds. We start. All right, let's get back at it, guys. Cross jacks. And dog in place, nice and easy. I wish I could put this on Sarah now. She's looking better than me right now. Jog. Halfway done. This one. coordinator right now. guys we can do this you got this burn off some stress burn off some energy and take a break we are going to plank hand to shoulder in a minute so grab a drink Hopefully you guys can see me here okay. Trying to keep our butts low here. Trying not to move our body. Keeping as still as possible. And 
jog. I might have to move it over to the thing because it hurts yeah. my hands on the turf. I'm going to flip it around. Yeah. I'm going to turn this. Go ahead. Uh -oh. All right, sorry. Can't see the clock, I know, but it was hard in my hands on the turf. And we got one left. Here we go. This is it. All right. Take a minute. Take a minute. We have power knees coming up in 50 seconds, so get a drink. to bring your heart rate up, but you can also bring your heart rate up going as fast as possible. So, right leg. <laughs> I know, I feel a little ridiculous doing this. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> and y'all, we're gonna go to our Left knee next. And left. Power that up. Pretty sure I used to do this in step aerobics, but pretty sure I used to do this on the step in the 90s. Jog. Back to our right. Left 
Two more, guys. Just two more. And back to our right side. And our last one is on our left. And let's do it. Keep going. 10 seconds, you got this. Go right to the end. Wait till you hear the beep. All right, take a break. Thirty seconds. One thing they say that's helping. <sighs> Janine is watching even though she's working. So one more thing. Keep drinking lots of water during this time. They say it helps wash away any virus particles that could get stuck in your throat. So if you keep staying hydrated, it's a very good thing. So keep hydrated. And I'm going to start in eight seconds. We're going to squat with a front kick. Okay, keep alternating legs. So, squat back, kick forward, squat, kick. Trying to keep that chest and head up. See how I'm looking at you right now? Keep that chest and head up. I don't want to see you falling like this. Not that I can see you, I guess. You guys are going to have to self-regulate for a while. And jog. Squat with a kick forward. Squat, kick, squat, kick. And jog. Hope you guys have some good tunes going here. I got some good music. Thanks to Sarah in my ear. Cause Facebook won't allow me to play music. Copyright law on Facebook. Oops, and job. Two left. Two left. Last one coming up. And break. Sorry, no jog. Take a break, guys. We're going to be doing jump ups next. Thirty seconds left. 
Is Gretchen in the group? I think so. So, we're, I don't know if she's watching. Next, coming up in 20 seconds, we're gonna be doing this for modified, or jump for a little more of a challenge. So you choose, try to challenge yourself a little bit, maybe try the jumps, and then go down to just the reach, okay? But you wanna try to get your heart rate up, so we're gonna start with the challenge here. Just that motion of raising the arms overhead, get your heart rate pumping. And jog. She said she couldn't see it. Can't see the video? Check your phone to make sure I'm in the right group. I'm in the COVID group and not the 30 day cleanse group. What's it called? COVID 19 or something. I'm not in it though. Can you get it? Oh, you can't get it. But check the cleanse and make sure I'm not in that. left guys Coming up upside down toe touches. You're doing awesome, I'm sure, even though I can't see you. I always thought that was weird when people say, you're doing great, because they don't know if we're doing great. <laughs> Such a turf. Huh? Yeah. 40 seconds left. I don't know about you, but it feels good to work out because quite honestly, Carrie Parker put on my Facebook a little fat baby and said how I feel after I ate all the quarantine all snacks. All the quarantine snacks. And it's so true. You're stuck at home just eating, 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 and it's scary and depressing. Alright, let's start in five seconds. Upside down toe touches. Reach up. Remember, we're going to do a bridge hold in between on this one. And do that bridge hold. Squeeze, engage your glutes here. Engage your quads, drive those heels into the floor and reach again.
halfway done. Times like this, I wish I had a lighting crew, makeup lighting crew, professional videographers at my disposal for you guys. This is so amateur hour, but it's gonna get the job done, right? And I think I said yesterday, we tried to do a, like a virtual class where I can see all of you, but it was kind of a, a fiasco, it just wasn't easy for people to log on. It got kind of confusing for people to join. And I really, if a whole bunch of you did it, I wouldn't be able to see you all anyway. So I was like, I think Facebook Live is just gonna have to work. This is it, this is our last one. Last five seconds. Awesome. And let's do a quick cool down. So remember, if you weren't able to tune in, hi Melissa, if you weren't able to tune in while we were doing this, I will post it to our group so you can watch it and do it any time of the day or even tomorrow if you wanted to. So um, look for it in the group. Cross your right leg over the left, pull it in. Stretching out our hips and our glutes here because we did a lot of that today. Jumping around, look over your right shoulder. Keeping your back straight, up on your sits bones, not back on your tailbone. Switch sides, left leg crosses over, pull it in. Keep that back straight, looking over our shoulder. And this is a great one if you have young kids to make them do it with you. If they're in your hair, say, okay, if you're going to be in here, you got to do this workout with me. They'll be very tired and they'll probably leave soon. So one leg in, one leg out. Take that right arm while I have my right knee in. So I'm going to take my right arm and bring it across, reaching for my toe. And back, other side. Left arm comes across, reaching for my toes. Back to the middle, I'm gonna bring both bottoms of my feet together and I'm gonna try to press my knees down, reaching towards the floor. Opening up our hips here. And then I'm going to spin it around in a tabletop position. Tabletop, my back is flat. And let's arch our back up. Remember, don't skip this part. I know it's gonna be tempting because you're at home. You're like, oh, I got something on the stove. No, don't leave anything on the stove while you're working out. And then look up, but um, don't skip this part of your workouts. The, the cool down is really important. It helps prevent injuries. Bring it back to a flat back. Curl the toes under, down dog. In down dog, tailbone is to the sky. Chest is pressing to the floor, letting the head hang and pedal your feet. Maybe for you guys, if you would like, let me know if you would like, put something in the comments. If you would like me to do a yoga video, bring one leg forward for you guys to just have um, kind of a relaxing yoga video if you had that time. I guess we all kind of have time now, don't we? And bring our left leg forward. <laughs> and bring it back, bring one arm back. Other side. 
across our body. Switch. Let's do our wrists last. This is for Mark Thomas. Here you go, the wrists. Lace the hands behind the back, squeeze the shoulder blades together. And you guys are done. Thank you for tuning in and let me know what you think of the videos, where I can make improvements if possible. Um, leave comments and um, I will be back again tomorrow, 6.30 p.m. I will be doing a class here at the gym. Yes, I know we will be um, limiting that, obviously, but we've only been getting a few people, so it's good. And we all spread out far apart. Um, we all sanitize our hands when we walk in, spread out, doing body weight stuff. And if we do touch anything, we're wiping it, and then we're leaving. So, um, you know, I'm kind of playing it day to day because I don't know what the future is going to hold for us if we are mandated to shut down, and I will. But I didn't want to, um, you know, I want to keep it going so that you guys have something to look for. So let me know how you feel about the videos and stay tuned. See you later.